We're going to take a look now at a new multimedia accelerator card. This one's called the Video Expression from ATI. Bal Sajpal of ATI Technologies is here to tell us about it. Uh, Bal, welcome. Thank you. Tell us about the Video Expression from ATI. The Video Expression is ATI's latest multimedia video and graphics accelerator. Okay. What we're trying to do with this card is provide both video and graphics acceleration in one card. Now we've got uh, some video uh, MPEG which we'll see and also some other stuff which we'll see. I'll let you tell us about that in a minute. But uh, actually right now I've got the, uh, the hardware edge sitting mm -hmm. right here. Why don't you give us a quick tour of what's on board? Sure. What we have here is the ATI 264VT mm -hmm. chip. This is the heart of the entire board. This controls everything. And this chip was developed in-house by ATI, so it allows us to design and customize it a little better to get more performance out of it. Excellent. And what we have here is the two megabytes of frame buffer memory mm -hmm. that come with the card, and that further optimizes your system. Okay. And the final, the really strong feature of this card is its upgradability. Okay. You can buy the card and you know that future, you know, a future path down the road is something here that's called the ATI Multimedia Channel. It allows you to plug in expansions such as the TV Tuner card mm -hmm. and therefore you can build on your original purchase and have some really value add there. So in other words, if, uh, if you want to upgrade and add uh, new features, you don't have to trash your original card, you just add to it. You connect new uh, cards to it. Yes, you just plug it right into the little pins here and you're up and running. Excellent. Well, this is, that's the hardware side. Let's go ahead and turn to the software side of things and see what we can do with the card installed. Okay, what we wanted to do is make this card very easy to use for end users because mm -hmm. computers are becoming complicated. We want people to just plug them in and start playing. So we've developed something that's called a getting started feature. It's mm -hmm. a little wizard that shows you how to do all the features of the, there's a whole host of applications that come with this card. Uh, everything's point and click, so when you change it, it'll tell you how to do it, where to click. It literally walks you through every feature. It's a nice change from how cards yeah, used to get installed. Exactly. Um, once you install the features, you have ATI customizable applications such as screen adjust, mm -hmm. simply point and click and it will move around wherever you want. Panning is the same feature, all point and click. We wanted everything to be very visual. Color features, if you're doing a work uh, desktop publishing, it's a really great feature. You can just move around like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, what we can also do here is a strong feature is the virtual desktop. We'll bring it up again. The virtual desktop is great for the economy person that's pur purchasing a uh, system. You can only really afford a 14-inch monitor. This allows you to have a huge workspace. As you can see here, here's the monitor. Mm -hmm. It allows you actually to have this large workspace and therefore save some money on a monitor. Excellent. So you can have effectively something like 17 inches or a 19-inch uh, worth of desktop real estate actually fitting only on a 14-inch monitor. Yes. You're able to scan around within it, I would imagine. Right. And, uh, Okay, now that's some of the settings. What can we actually do? Let's talk about the video. Yeah, the MPEG video is a really strong feature. We have something that's called the ATI Video Player. Mm -hmm. We've made the controls very TV and VCR-like. You have a simple play button right here. Mm -hmm. You have your rewind, you have full screen, fast forward, you can load your clips in a slider control for volume. Okay, we wanted it to be very uh, familiar to the end user. Yeah. Let's see how it looks. Now this is a clip. We'll just go to full screen. And it looks just like TV. It's full screen, full motion. You really can't tell the difference if this is off my computer or if it's a TV channel. And this is really smooth. I'm not seeing any uh, of the artifacts that are sometimes associated with blowing yeah. a video up this big. Yes, yeah, so we're really impressed by this, the software MPEG of this. It's, uh, you can drag it around. Mm -hmm. It's just another application. You can just make it small while you're working on your spreadsheet. You can have it up in the corner. You can be watching a little tape. And because this is actually being uh, run by the card, you don't worry about slowing down your system if you're running other applications. Exactly. The card will do all the work for you. Mm -hmm. You don't have to tap your system resources. Okay, let's talk now about the TV tuner upgrade aspect. Fine. The TV tuner plugs into the video expression and mm -hmm. it's cable ready. We just plug the cable into the back of the card and you get live cable feed over your computer. You also have excellent features such as closed caption, mm -hmm. which you have on regular TV, but what you do with this closed caption is you can save it to disk, you can search for special words, mm -hmm. and when those words come up in the transcript, it'll automatically save it to your disk and you can look at it later. So this is really coming off our cable right now. We've got the cable plugged into, I should say, into the back of our card, scrolling through channels here. Yep. And you could just choose any channel. You can zoom in on anything you want. It's live video scaling right here. You're looking at her badge at her face, Courtney, are you saying and if you, you want to say, okay, I want to see what her badge looks like, you yeah. can zoom right into it, died, and you can also go to full screen to watch TV. Just like with the uh, MPEG player, the video exactly. player as well. Okay, well, this is the TV tuner upgrade part. Uh, we're talking about the video expression here from ATI with uh, MPEG playback. 
got the TV tuner upgrade option, and it also does regular gra graphics acceleration to accelerate your everyday tasks. Yes, all in one solution. Thank you very much, Bell, for showing it to us. You're welcome. We'll see more ways to do video with your computer when we come back. <laughs>